The episode of The Young and the Restless recap on Monday, November 9th. The recap featured a reading of Dina's will and Kyle's anger towards Theo again. Meanwhile, Chance questions Adam about Chelsea leaving without a bag, and Sally has a new job she's not very happy about. At the Abbott Mansion, Kyle questions why Theo was there, according to a note that he is family. After a few quarrels, Jack entered and asked Theo to stay. The lawyer appeared, and she announced that Dina wanted Abby to read the will. Dina rules that her property is divided between Jack, Ashley, and Tracy, then she mentioned her grandchildren. Kyle received Dina's art collection, and Abby received an apartment in Paris. Finally, Dina mentioned Eric Vanderwey, Theo's father. She left him a letter explaining that she and Stuart Brooks were his parents. Then she handed her a favorite pen that Stuart had left for her under his will. Theo expressed satisfaction with his inheritance, while Kyle made sure to dig some of the assets. Jack finally urged his son to remove it. After that, Theo had some drinks at the guild and Sally was there. He told her about being tricked into losing his inheritance, and she told him it looked like he was doing something. Before that, Sally met Lorne and asked about a job. Lauren didn't know anything at the level Sally wanted, but she offered her her personal assistant. Sally accepted, but she didn't seem very pleased with it. At Jabbit, Sally talked to Jack about Jabbit Collective, but he noted that the company has decided to focus on cosmetics only at the moment. Sally sees Summer walking in the park, and she's asking her to exchange contact information, since they are working in the same building. Kyle stepped forward, and Sally immediately felt he was another old Summer lover. After Sally left, Kyle talked about Theo, and Summer said she feels sorry for him. Kyle wondered if maybe her ex-boyfriend was the problem and said of his ex-wife. Adam has a box of Chelsea fixtures in his penthouse. He took her phone and sent a group message from that, saying that Chelsea was traveling to meet. At Chancellor Communications, Chloe told Chance about Chelsea's quirky text. She encouraged him to look into her disappearance. Chance goes to Adam's apartment and confronts him. Adam tried to play it off, but he stumbled upon the details of the group text, which made Chance suspicious. Chance notices the box and asks what is inside. Adam says those are new books. The young Adam continued to work on his old self. They can still stop this, he argued. However, he said it was too late and that Chelsea would not be injured. 